I get to show that women can be very powerful. <laughs> I don't need a note from my mom after I hit people. I can prove that blondes do have more fun. Because I know you will be watching me. I became Gladiator two years ago um, when Ray Hollett got pregnant, so I kind of got lucky because that left an opening for the Gladiators, and I went and tried out against 20 other girls, and I just happened to make it. In the heat of battle, Ice instinctively turns on the kind of pressure that makes the opponents melt down. Actually, I don't look at it as a comic book hero in any way, as far as my name goes with the character. Um, what you see on TV basically is, is me. I am, I'm very competitive, I'm aggressive, and I love to play hard. Well, 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 Nitro. Ellen. Now I see the truth. I was just a pawn in your sick little gladiator love game. The story has the two fighting over another one of the Gladiator regulars, Nitro. But once these gals started thumping each other, it was hard to tell who was going to be left standing. You know what? She was really good, actually, because of the fact she kept going, you can hit me harder if you want. You can hit me harder. We got to make this look real. You can hit me hard. So I wailed on her a few times. <laughs> I don't want to make her mad because she's... Not that... Oh, she's sorry. huge. Hey, I am huge. She's huge. Being a gladiator means more than just bouncing on the bungee. As role models to a new generation, they want to put over a positive message. You know, like my next-door neighbors, it's like, Ice lives next door to us, you know? It's, just, it's a lot of fun. It's like their smile comes over their face, you know? Oh, that's Ice. Lori Fetrick spends her time off teaching kids the value of nutrition and exercise. Being a role model, especially for little girls, is an honor. I mean, the kids are so important, you know? To really see that a female can get out there and do it. And you know what, I just want to say, this is fabulous that you guys are dedicating this whole month to health and fitness. Oh, I yeah. Mean, oh, right. we, we think so, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, I'm currently writing a book called Pure Fitness with a psychologist by the name of Robert Epstein. Mm -hmm. And um, Pure Fitness. Yes. Good. Fitness. And you have video as well, right? Yes, I do, actually. And um, I'm basically working on becoming a very positive role model as uh -huh. far as the health and fitness industry. Hi, I'm Lori Fetrick, and welcome to my video. You probably know me from the show American Gladiators, but long before I appeared on television, I was very serious about training. In this video, I'm going to be using some of my favorite training techniques. And if you're serious about getting or staying in shape, you Before we get started with the body conditioning today, I can't stress enough, safety comes first. Model was my father. He was um, very easygoing, and um, yet he wasn't afraid of letting his daughter go fishing with him play in, you know, play in the yard with him. I was a little tomboy, yes, and he accepted me for that. But what people don't understand is that people think that they can go in and they're like, oh, I'm going to take steroids, so I'm going to look this good. When you're, I mean, that's not the issue. That's not the case. You have to work, I mean, 150% in that gym. Drugs are drug free. I mean, it doesn't matter, you know, mm -hmm. and I think it's like definitely the wrong way to go because of the fact that it's so harmful to your health. But you have to work hard and you got to want it. Stay strong. Have fun, enjoy life, and dreams can come true. You can do anything you want to do. I never dreamed I'd become a gladiator, but if I hadn't been prepared when tryouts came around, I wouldn't have gotten the job. I was up against stiff competition, but I had such a positive state of mind, nothing could stop me. When you make a commitment to yourself that brings you closer to your fitness goal, really honor that commitment. You'll be amazed how much you can accomplish and how this attitude carries over into every part of your life not just your workout. Shake that body, shake that body for me. Hi there. You guys gonna be at uh, Drew's party? Uh, I'm in a relationship. Because <laughs> if you're there, we're there. We want to party with you. You bring me some of that party, girl. <laughs> I'm in a relationship. <laughs> I just got engaged. 
you want to dance? Well, uh, you know, I... Did my voice go up? Because that wasn't a question. Uh, hold that thought, or don't hold on to that. I'm um, second thought, hold that, and let me go check on something that's going on here.